Hi everybody, Daryl here. Want to give you an update of uh, the thing that we've been holding off for a while just because of timing issues. But behind me, we have our tie stalls feeder system. And even though I've shown you videos before of the work that was done with the concrete and the new stalls and the reshaping of the land and uh, just the improvements that were made on it, I also want to let you know that we are now finished with it. And so what I'm showing you here is that what we've added, the last thing we added to it were extensions. So if you look at the tie stalls behind me, to the left and to the right, we added another three feet so that when kids are collecting their horses, they're not standing in the rain, where before it kind of ended very abruptly and people are getting wet. So we added extensions. So I'm going to walk you through that right now. And so you can see it. Uh, we just finished it today. We're very happy about that. The, the work crew that did a good job, very pleased. So come with me. We're going to walk over there and take a look. All right. Excellent. So we just finished it, like I said, today, and we've been working on this for a while. We waited a whole year. Uh, things Getting the right size of tin was a bit difficult. So what I'm going to show you here is, if you can see this, there is the extension that we did. I think that looks pretty good. And so now where I'm standing, I'm not in the rain where we would have the kids stand by a pole and say, wait for your horse. And now the kids are no longer getting wet and the horses are a little bit drier and the rain flows off a little bit better. We're very pleased with that. But there was something else that was done that we're also excited about as we go this way. Staff keeping everything nice and clean. If you remember, there's our tie stalls, nice concrete base, except where the horses are standing. We don't have a concrete base there. That's all sand. And everything just looks really, really professional. We're so proud. Um, and so the crew that did this for us, very, very pleased. Now, I'm going to show you something that they did for us for free. And that's in closing up here. That used to be wide open, all that there. And so we would have snow and rain coming through there. And now that won't happen. So they did a very nice job in closing that. Now we have people sitting here for lessons or getting ready for lessons. Now they get to be all nice and dry. So we're very happy with that. I'm going to show you the other side of this very quickly. Okay, once we get here and you'll see the other side, we are very happy. There you go. Um, we got a lot of rain. So, so that's the enclosure that they did. And they very, did a very nice job. And it was very kind that they would do that for us for free. Really appreciate that. So I just wanted to give you the final update on the tie stall situation. We had a wonderful, wonderful couple, family couple, uh, who donated uh, money for the renovation of this. I will send this to them and thank them. And uh, just to say, hey, this is where it went. We're finished. We're very happy. The place looks great. Thank you very much to that uh, couple that donated in order for this area to be improved. As well as they did the, uh, they brought a whole, they, their donation got us a whole bunch of sand for the indoor riding arena which is awesome. Thank you very much. It's still doing well. And we have a little extra in order to fill some of the, the, hole, the holes around here. So anyway, that's it from Daryl, director of Birch Bay Ranch. We're very pleased and the indoor, the uh, tie stall feeder system is finished. Thank you very much. God bless you, everybody. Stay tuned for more updates because we got something exciting happening. You may have seen a video. We are starting the cabins. I'll get you I'll get you an update on that. All right, God bless. Bye-bye.